Now, Kenyan athletes recorded numerous wins across various competitions throughout the year. The successful hosting of the World Under-18 Championships in the country, however, ranked high in Kenya's track and field success of the year. Take a look. Nairobi, Kenya, the city picked to host the last edition of the World Under-18 Athletics Championships, rights granted owing to Kenya's contribution to athletics, a gamble by the International Association for Athletics Federation, with hopes that the country would host a memorable championships. <laughs> A full stadia characterized the final two days of the 2017 World Under-18 Championships at the 60,000 uh, capacity Kasarani Stadium, or close to 10,000 fans, were turned away. Kenya delivered the largest attendance in the history of the competition. You can stand up and say, Kenya, you did it. The athletic world is saying, thank you, Kenya, because I don't think they have ever seen or witnessed a spectacle like the one that was in Kasarani. Billions of shillings are spent by the Kenyan government to host the last ever World Under-18 Athletics Championships at the Moy Stadium, Kasarani. Kenyan athletes, among 800 other athletes taking part in the Games, 700 volunteers also part of these games, over 60,000 fans also turned up on the last day of the event here at the Moy Stadium, Kasarani. We speak to the stakeholders to ask, was the money spent by the government worth it? So as much as we place importance on agriculture, on security, on other sectors, the sporting sector is up the ladder. It's one of the premier areas for a country as vibrant and as young as Kenya. Secondly, if you take the cost of these games vis-a-vis -vis the extent to which we have managed to sell ourselves out there, I mean, at every start, it's magic or Kenya. The impact, you know, in terms of economic impact of, of a major event like this is a lot of infrastructural upgrades. You know, this stadium has uh, been really transformed. It's a beautiful stadium. You know, whether you're sitting up in the, in the stands or whether you're watching it on TV, you can really see, you know, the work that the local organizing committee has put into upgrading. Um, of course, you know, it does create jobs. Kenya sports people, sports women and men have contributed immensely into shaping the image of our country. Kenya is of age. It means that next year we will be, and I hope you will join us, be in the front line to bid for the 2020 Under-20 Championships. The event also gave the legends of the sport a chance to celebrate their sport. When you become a world champion, it's something, uh, it's a big thing to become among now the, you know, the best athletes. In Kasalani, Kenya has been able to get the best athletes in the world. It's been a long time, it's been a long time, it's been a long time. It's been a long time, it's been a long time, it's been a long time, it's been a long time. Thank you.